Hey guys, and well, woo. Fuck off, Cortana. Hey guys, and welcome back to Outlast. When we last left off, we were running away from a mad-ass chef with a, some kind of circular saw. So let's keep going. And I'm assuming... Oh! Fuck, where was that from? What even was that? I have no idea. I don't know what made that noise. But here we are in the labs. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Documentation. Uh, Project Wall Rider. Patient status report for Frank uh, Manor. Uh, Frank Antonio Manor. Date of patient consultant. Oh, 2010, 1101. Age 36, male. Therapy status, minimal morphogenic engine activity, and only at extreme stages, stages 5 and 6. Levels of hormone therapy, dream states return repeatedly, so images of isolation and betrayal. Zero lucid state. Diagnostics, heavy bronchial accumulation, constant with patients with histories of tobacco and marijuana, exceptionally low REM activity. Hmm. At the time of his, this interview, Frank was down to 155 pounds from his administration weight of 228. Holy hell. He was lethargic and largely non-responsive, exhibiting interest only in hypnotherapy script pattern 9, Wer Wernicke. Concerning drinking blood from the chest of a sleeping of sleeping men he continues to refuse baths or the attention of a barber outside of general anesthesia stating if i cannot partake i cannot share recommend forced nutrition for mr manor if we cannot find something he likes to eat hmm so that is the chef so it's frank Frank the chef. Alright. Well, at least he's finally found something that he likes to eat. You have to look at all the uh, positives. Who said that? Hey, look. If you get killed, buddy, that's your own dealing. Who is saying that? Oh, you. Alright, buddy. Well, maybe you shouldn't work for an evil corporation. It's kind of hard to feel sorry for you. I'm not going to lie. No batteries. Ooh. Oh, this is... This is very gassy in here. Is this gas going to kill us? I don't think so. Some batteries would be really nice, though. What was that awful sound? I think that's just the ambient music. Ooh. What do we have here? Gooey bits. And not the good kind of gooey bits. Alright. Oh, is that our friend? Yep, that's our friend. Mr. Frank. Frankie. Oh, I love you. God damn it. Frank, I don't like you, Frank. Okay. I tried to give you a chance, Frank. Okay, we could have been pals. We could both have been quaffing delicacies. But no. You had to be a goit. You had to try and have your oh, way with me. Which I wasn't a fan of. I'm going to be straight up with you. 
That sounds close. Ooh. That sounds incredibly close. Oh, fuck. Where the hell are you? Hey, buddy. We really need to talk about this. You know, eating flesh is some kind of addiction. You know, and I, and I understand. Oh, God. You probably can't help it. But I'd really be your best friend if you would take me off the menu. You know, you can you can eat anybody else you like. But not me. It's not a lot to ask for, you know? I just don't want to be turned into feces. Really? If that's all the same. And this place is huge, a maze-like. I have no idea where the frick I'm going. <sighs> and I really wish I could turn down the ambient soundtrack. Because A, I don't think it's that good. And B, it's absolutely deafening. Quite frankly. Nothing in here either. Oh. Uh, itchy eye at the worst possible time. Right. Okay, Frankie. Where the hell's the valve, Frankie? You tell me where the valve is, and I'll be out of here, alright? That's a pretty good deal, if you ask me. Ooh. Do these pipes need... Ooh. Oh, hello. Alright there, pal. That's right, you go that way. You dick. Ah, yes, I am very close. You're, in fact, swinging your sword into my face. Or your saw, I should say. Fuck you, Frankie. Fuck you. Ah, god damn it. I am so lost. Damn it, this is like a dead end. I mean, it's not like a dead end, it is a dead end. Where the hell is the valve? It has to be in here somewhere, surely. Gas room, well that makes sense. I suppose. Oh, no. Well, apparently, gas room, here we go. Oh. Well, that's good. Okay, that that's kind of promising. But we need to turn the gas off first. Right, he's coming from that way, so we can go this way. Now, if I was a gas valve, where would I be? It's got to be in the central area somewhere, surely. Because it sure as shit ain't out here. God damn it, Frankie! Look, I'm just. You know what, buddy? Just chase me. I'm actually faster than you. I hope this upsets you on a higher level. The fact that no matter how hard you try, if I'm running and you're running, you can't catch me unless I screw up. Like that. Hello. <laughs> You're right. Yeah, remember when I said you can't catch me unless I screw up? Prime example. Uh, or run into the wall. Damn it. Or stop responding to controls. I'd rather not if it's all the same. And we are running out of battery. I'm assuming that we've actually missed. 
the gas thing somewhere. Like, we have massively made a wrong turn. I mean, surely, right, the gas valve has got to be pretty obvious. Can't get up there. Um, There's nowhere above us that we can jump. Gas room. Yeah, gas room's one thing, but... We don't want the gas room, we want the damn valve. Right, let's just hide here. Can we see it anywhere? It's not in there, is it? No, that's just another room. I'm not too bothered about him finding us. And chasing us. Because we can pretty easily get away. I would have thought that if we just simply followed these pipes, it would lead us to where we need to go. But, that does not seem to be the way it works. Or is it? See, now this is leading to the gas room. Unless there's another way into the gas room, like, oh, I don't know, up here. God damn it. There we go. Look at that. We've wasted almost a whole load of batteries. There we go. Okay, cool. Uh, gas room. Now, I would like some batteries if I could. No? Not going to give me any batteries at all. Dicks. Okay. Right, well, off with the gas. Gas leaker? I've been called worse things. So I'll let you have that one. Alright. Good enough. Now let me guess, he's going to burst through that door. Maybe. Okay, so the gas still works. Right, I think he's that way, so... I'm assuming we just now have to make our way back. Now, assumptions... Oh, shit. Hey, pal. Oh, I can hide from you. I'm actually really bloody good at it as well. If I say so myself. See? All I have to do is run into a dark bit, and you're fucked. Well, alright. Maybe a little bit more. Come on. Let's give you the slip. I hope you slip. And, uh, catch yourself in the gonads. With your chainsaw. Yeah. I can smell you too. And it's not a pleasant smell. Oh, hello! You dickbag. You're making me look silly now. Not that that is particularly hard. I will grant you that. You didn't have to be a dick about it, but... I will give you that. Are you right behind me? Yeah, you still know where I am. How do you all of a sudden know where I am constantly? Oh, oh. Hi. Right, let's try and remember what way we came in here. It was this way, I think. Yes. Yes, it was. See you later, buddy. At least I hope it was this way. Yes. Yes, it was. And we have batteries. Excellent. Okay. I'm hoping we get to kill him in a deliciously horrible way. And I'm hoping we get to do it relatively soon. Because he deserves it. I think he really deserves... Oh, Oh, that was strange. He deserves a horrifically brutal death. And I, for one, would be honoured... To give it to him. You know? 
I mean, it's probably a kindness at this point. Bastard constantly worrying about what he's going to eat. We could take that, uh, take that difficult choice away from him. And where the hell are we now? This is weird. We cannot use light amplification. I can hear people. Oh, we're not going that way. There's def we're definitely not alone out here. Now, I'm hoping they're just playing basketball somewhere. However, that's probably not what's happening. They're probably out there thinking and hoping that someone... Oh, shit. Someone is going to run by so they can eat our face. What the fuck was that? Oh, what was that? Someone like ran up to us and stabbed us in the back, I think. Which isn't very nice. Did we come from here? No, I don't think so. Uh, I think we're going the right way. Oh. Alright. Calm down, buddy. Calm down. Look. Piss off you. Both of you. Why don't you go and stab each other? I think you can do that. That's fine. I won't even mind if you stabbed each other. I support this. Alright, calm down, Waylon. Luckily, wherever we were horribly stabbed was not that, uh, not that crucial. It was not a vital organ that got poked. Which was quite nice. It's always awkward when they get you in the kidney or, or the heart or something. But luckily, they always seem to stick you in the regenerator gland which is quite nice um crap hey buddy calm down in fact I think oh no I was going to say I think I'm about to make my way into you but uh, no we're going to be sly and go this way oh, I say sly We appear to be in a dead end. Yeah. Okay, so the guard house is a dead end. I think. Yeah, I would say definitely a dead end. Can we... Uh, I'm guessing we can't go in there because that chap tried. What? What? I can hear voices, but not the good kind of voices. Not the kind of voices that soothe you to sleep. The horrible voices. The ones that want to stab you in the regen gland. See, this looks like it should have a reason of being here. Ah. Can we? No, we can't get on top of that. This feels right. It feels like we should be here. But I guess not. Oh. Oh, hello. It was basketball. What the hell? No freaking way. He's playing alone and losing. That's what the game is. There is a mathematical proof. If you add 1 plus 2... Uh, 3 plus 4, yeah, 4 plus 5, and so on, up to infinity, you can arrive at an answer. If you stop shy of infinity, you have a indescribably large number. If you continue all the way to infinity, you arrive at, uh, right, 
I'm losing my... Yeah, I think you are losing your grip on things. I'm thinking about the drive here. Four, 400 miles in a rented truck. The job that shows up just in time to cover our bills, our debts, the insurance, the boys sleeping in the back, nothing but AM radio. Gospel, country western, late night paranormal... Uh, Oh, paranoic radio talk. We sang Patsy Klein songs and laughed at conspiracies of aliens and ghosts. Mile marker uh, numbers passing in the headlights. I don't want to die here. No, I don't want you to die here either. But considering how the last game ended... Oh. Yeah, considering how the last bit ended, uh, I'm not sure. Is there nowhere to go here at all? I guess not. So is that not the right way to go? Fuck off, mate. Oh. I think he's just opened this area up for us. On that case, cheers, buddy. Hello. Wow. That's one hell of a chiropractor that did that to you, mate. Hmm. Well, I'm guessing this is new ground. Can't even pretend to open that one. Now, he's blocking that with his body, so I suppose we're going this way. Oh, we can hear wolves. That's generally not a good thing. I say generally. I mean, you know, wolves are dogs and dogs are pretty cool. My mate's just got a new dog, actually. He's called Vince. A tiny little puppy. Uh, he is a Collie Cross Pug, of all things. Ah, okay. They all seem to have died with their radios in their hands, haven't they? Uh oh. <coughs> oh. Oh, hello. Hi, right, buddy. I see you. You are a mental patient. You belong here. I do not. I don't think. I think I, I'm firing on all cylinders still. It's kind of hard to tell, to be honest, because we've we're seeing some weird things. Ooh, can we go under here? No. Good thinking, Waylon, but that's not the answer. Oh, this looks promising. All right, well, there's lots of coaster wheels here, but I don't think we can really do anything with those. Up and Adam. Well, this place seems crazy. Oh, do we get to play basketball? <gasps> I think we might. We might. What have we been writing here? It's a load of foreign stuff, I think. What's that? Yeah, that's foreign. Damn foreigners. Writing incomprehensible gobbledygook. Hey, fellas. He looks nervous. I would like to kill him. Who, me? Oh! That's the Bulls Brothers. I oh, know, they're still not wearing pants. Still not uh, wearing pants. So you bastards were stabbing me. That's not very nice. Dicks. Literal dicks. Ooh. Exercise equipment. Really? That seems silly. To have that stuff. At Whoa. Do you even lift, bruh? He lifted his own head off. Hell up. So the Bulls brothers appear to be the ones running around, stabbing us in the back. You know, maybe it's not a knife that they're sticking us in the back with. Hello. You alright, chaps? You are both ridiculously ugly as well. 
They don't seem to be quite as insane as they were. Ooh. Well, that's definitely ahead. Hello there, guys. You having fun? Uh oh. Me? What did I do? You guys... You guys can play all you like. I'm just spectating. I would have had a friendly wager with you. Honestly, these people... Let's hope they're not smart enough to climb ladders. Really? God damn it. That would have been too easy. Oh, okay, well, I guess we can get in here after all. So, what do we have? The Wall Rider Delusion from Jay Billings. Uh, Kurt, I've got another one, and I'm not sure you're going to be able to check it off as a psychiatric psychopathic proximity disorder security guard all the way up here in the admin block is our latest non-patient employee to start seeing Wer Wernicke's fairy tales he was never directly exposed to the engine never even made it below level one in the building but it would be an enormous breach of protocol and security if doctors were speaking of the wall rider within hearing uh, of a contracted security guard Huh. And uh, and seems vanishingly improbable that he would stumble onto such an obscure mythological story on his own. It's too similar to the Dr. Samuel case or the others before him. It's the one thing for formerly the sane medical personnel to fall under the delusions of their patients. It's another thing entirely for those beliefs to be, I don't know, airborne? We need to talk in person. Yeah. Intriguing. It sounds like a cat is making loads of noise. In fact, I better end this video here and go check what those cats are doing. So, when we come back, guys, we're going to continue through this into the prison, is it? Is that where we're trying to get? Where are we trying to get? Yeah. The prison and use the radio. So, guys, thanks for watching, and as always, till next time.